Hello everyone and say hello to the brand new Curse Forge Overwolf launcher. Curse Forge have partnered with Overwolf to bring us a much needed new and improved Curseful launcher for our mod and add-on needs. There is a lot of feedback and controversy about this but I'll get to my review at the end of this video. But right now I'm going to show you how to download and install this launcher if you do want to try, if you want to test it, if you want to give them feedback. So the first thing you need to do is go to the website above curseforge.overwolf.com and download the new launcher. Click download Mac OS or Windows if you're on either of those operating systems and then press OK. Once the download has completed in your web browser, either double click the DMG to launch it or go into your finder into your downloads folder and then open the DMG itself. Mac OS will then verify the application before you can install it. Once the launcher has been verified, you can then drag the curse launcher.app into your applications folder. Double click the application and you can open the brand new Curse Forge Overwolf launcher. As you can see, the launcher is very buggy. I had this issue multiple times when I was trying to record this, so I had to stop recording and then eventually it launched without any issues. Now, the main thing you'll notice about this launcher is that there are ads on the right hand side of it. 70% of the money made from those ads will go to the actual developer themselves. It's annoying but you can buy a subscription for the launcher but I don't think a lot of people will be doing that just because it is in beta. There are issues with it especially on the Mac OS version. The icons are very very dark which you can see in the video. You do have the ability to change a few settings, manage your add-ons, your mods, change your privacy settings and even scan your computer for mods and games you may already Already have installed you can join the curse forge discord you can send them feedback as well which you definitely should do to improve this launcher because it is pretty terrible at the moment to be honest especially how dark it is on mac os the issues that i've been having with it as well all i would say that some people aren't happy with this me included because curse forge have just they haven't made their own launcher they're bloating another launcher um, I never understood why they partnered with Twitch. I never understood why Curseful was a part of the Twitch application. It makes no sense. It's just a RAM guzzler. So if you do have this launcher, tell me what you think about it down below. If you think the same way as me, as in they need to make their own launcher so it's not as bloated and as bad as it already is, let me know down below and I'll see you in the next video. Peace out.